In the hazy glow of nostalgia, let us journey back to a time when the flickering screen held a world of enchantment, where tales were spun in monochrome threads, and characters stepped out from the realm of imagination to become household names. Imagine, if you will, that moment when you first stumbled upon the 1955 television series, Cheyenne. The air was thick with anticipation as the screen came to life, and the opening notes of its theme song echoed through the room, a melody that would forever be etched into the tapestry of your memories. Perhaps it was the rugged charm of Clint Walker's portrayal of Cheyenne Bodie that drew you in, a lone drifter with a heart of gold and a fierce sense of justice. Or maybe it was the untamed landscapes that served as the backdrop for his adventures, each episode an exploration of the uncharted west, a canvas painted with both danger and possibility. Do you remember the exhilaration as Cheyenne faced down outlaws and righted wrongs? The thrill as he stared down the barrel of danger, unflinching in the face of adversity. Those were the moments that ignited a fire within you, a passion for storytelling that still burns today. And now, as we set the stage for a deeper dive into the show that captured hearts across generations, let's uncover some lesser-known gems about Cheyenne. These random facts, like hidden treasures waiting to be discovered, will shed new light on the series that once held you spellbound. So, prepare to be intrigued, for the world of Cheyenne is more intricate than meets the eye. It's a tapestry woven with history, characters, and anecdotes that have stood the test of time. Are you ready to unravel the mysteries that lie beneath the surface? But for now, let the echo of that theme song linger in your mind. A whisper of bygone days when heroes roamed the black and white frontier of your screen. Reflect on the moments that made you laugh, cry, and believe in something greater. Because in the end, it's the memories we carry that truly endure. And now, without further ado, let's embark on this journey of discovery together as we uncover the hidden threads of Cheyenne, one fact at a time. Cheyenne, a TV series that premiered in 1955, stands as a notable Western show, setting the stage for the genre's prominence on television. Originating from the popular Warner Bros. studio, the series offered viewers a captivating narrative centered around the enigmatic loner Cheyenne Bodie. Portrayed by Clint Walker, Bodie became an iconic character whose rugged charm and moral compass drew audiences in. The show's uniqueness lay in its episodic structure combined with a serialized touch, offering standalone stories while allowing character development to unfold across episodes. This format lent the series an air of novelty, distinguishing it from other westerns of its time. As Cheyenne gained momentum, it not only boosted the careers of its cast and creators, but also laid the groundwork for the proliferation of Western-themed TV content. With its distinctive style, Cheyenne impacted popular culture significantly. The show's mix of action, adventure, and moral dilemmas resonated with viewers, shaping perceptions of the Wild West and influencing subsequent Western series. This cultural impact extended beyond its original run, as the legacy of Cheyenne continues to reverberate through the Western genre even today. Venturing into the lesser-known aspects of the show, it's intriguing to note that the character of Cheyenne Bodie was initially created as a one-off guest appearance on another Warner Bros. show. However, Clint Walker's portrayal left such an impression that it led to the birth of the Cheyenne series. Additionally, the series was known for its strong guest star appearances, featuring several actors who would later become famous in their own right. As the show progressed, it shifted from black and white to color in its fifth season, embracing the evolving television technology of the time. This transition mirrored the changing landscape of the industry and showcased the show's adaptability. Cheyenne continues to hold a place in television history as a trailblazing Western series that set the stage for a genre that remains beloved by audiences. Its unique style, impactful characters, and influence on popular culture market is a true icon of its era, leaving an indelible mark on the world of television. Clint Walker's bare-chested stint on Cheyenne, debunking the myth contrary to popular belief. Clint Walker's brawny physique was a constant spectacle on the iconic 1955 TV series Cheyenne. While the show's rugged protagonist, portrayed by Walker, was often associated with his shirtless scenes, the reality diverges from the myth. Out of the 107 episodes graced by Walker's presence, his chiseled torso only made appearances in a mere 25 of them. 
The division is as follows. During the inaugural season, a mere six episodes showcased Walker's bare-chested bravado. The pattern continued in season two, with six more episodes featuring his iconic physique. Season three saw an uptick, with seven episodes dedicated to his shirtless escapades. As the seasons unfolded, the number dwindled. Season 4 displayed Walker's chest in four instances, and in the final leg of the series, Season 6, his shirt was off in only two episodes. The truth behind this oft-misunderstood aspect of Cheyenne adds a layer of complexity to Clint Walker's portrayal. While his imposing presence was undeniable, his shirtless moments were a carefully measured component of the show's appeal. Cheyenne's lone journey smit his swift departure when Cheyenne galloped onto screens in 1955. It was accompanied by a sidekick, Smitty, portrayed by L.Q. Jones. However, this duo's partnership was short-lived. After just three episodes, Smitty vanished from the narrative, leaving Cheyenne to continue his adventures alone. The dynamic shifted, but it paved the way for a solo journey that defined the series' trajectory. The abrupt departure of Smitty showcased the creator's willingness to evolve the narrative swiftly. Cheyenne's newfound solitude didn't deter the show's success. In fact, it allowed Clint Walker's character to shine even brighter, captivating audiences with his rugged charm and heroic exploits. From deputy sheriff to on-screen enforcer, Clint Walker's dual identity Cheyenne wasn't just a role for Clint Walker. It was a merging of his on-screen persona with real-life experience. Before pursuing a career in acting, Walker had worn a different badge, that of a deputy sheriff. This background bestowed authenticity upon his portrayal of a character who often assumed temporary law enforcement roles within the series. The seamless transition between Walker's past and the roles he portrayed on the show lent an air of credibility to Cheyenne's various law enforcement endeavors. The authenticity of his performances added depth to the character and resonated with audiences, solidifying Clint Walker's legacy as both a lawman of the past and a heroic figure of the small screen. In the sprawling landscape of 1,955 seconds television offerings, Cheyenne stands tall as a show that defied conventions and sparked imaginations. The truth about Clint Walker's shirtless scenes, the enigmatic disappearance of Smitty, and the convergence of his real-life experiences with his on-screen persona paint a richer picture of this enduring classic. In a television landscape dominated by rugged cowboys and sweeping vistas, the 1955 series Cheyenne stood as a true icon of the Western genre. While the show achieved fame for its gripping storylines and charismatic lead, Clint Walker as Cheyenne Bodie had also bore witness to the era's norms and idiosyncrasies. One such facet was the unique evolution of the series itself. During its run, Cheyenne underwent a transformation, briefly becoming The Cheyenne Show. This innovative format featured Cheyenne rotating weekly with two other Western protagonists, Sugarfoot and Bronco. This intriguing experiment showcased a trio of distinct personalities, offering viewers a dynamic range of frontier adventures. However, amidst the thrilling narratives and breathtaking landscapes, the series also reflected the racial dynamics of its time. A common practice in many Western television shows and movies of that era was the casting of white actors in Native American roles. Cheyenne was no exception, as many Indian characters were portrayed by white individuals. This reflection of the prevailing norms serves as a reminder of the era's complexities and attitudes. A lesser-known connection takes us beyond the boundaries of Cheyenne itself, leading us to the popular series 77 Sunset Strip. In a surprising crossover, Cheyenne and his pistol made an appearance in a 1963 episode of 77 Sunset Strip. The character Cal Jasper lent his gun to Stuart Bailey, creating an unexpected link between two iconic shows. As we revisit the legacy of Cheyenne, we uncover these layers of history and innovation. The series' dynamic transformations, casting choices, and unexpected crossovers all contribute to its enduring impact Cheyenne on television Jackson, and the, the Western genre. From the small screen hero in the annals of television history, the iconic 1955 TV series Cheyenne stands as a testament to the enduring power of the Western genre. The titular character, portrayed by the rugged Clint Walker, galloped into the hearts of viewers with his charisma and bravado. However, lesser known is the fact that actor Cheyenne Jackson owes his unique name to this very show. Born in 1975, Cheyenne Jackson, 
The accomplished stage and screen actor was bestowed with a name that resonates with the spirit of the Old West. The moniker Cheyenne was inspired by the eponymous character from the television series that captured the imagination of audiences during its run. The show, which followed the adventures of a wandering cowboy named Cheyenne Bodie, became a cultural touchstone, and its influence extended beyond the small screen. The connection between Cheyenne Jackson and the TV series is more than just a coincidence. It represents the far-reaching impact that television can have on individuals and their identities. In an era where television was rapidly becoming a centerpiece of popular culture, the character of Cheyenne Bodie left an indelible mark, one that would reverberate through generations. While Cheyenne Jackson's acting career may have taken him down a different path from the rugged landscapes of the Old West, his name remains a tribute to the timeless allure of a bygone era, preserved in the flickering images of a television series that continues to shape lives in unexpected ways. From the dusty trails of the American frontier to the bright lights of Hollywood, the legacy of Cheyenne lives on, encapsulated not only in the character, but also in the name it inspired. In a world where names carry stories and histories, Cheyenne Jackson's name stands as a testament to the lasting influence of television and the unexpected connections it forges. The spirit of the West, embodied by a fictional cowboy and embraced by an actor, serves as a reminder that the impact of a television series can extend far beyond the confines of the screen. Cheyenne Jackson's name is not just a label, it's a homage to a character that rode through the vast landscapes of television history, leaving an indelible mark on culture and identity. As we bid adieu to the captivating world of Cheyenne, the timeless 1955 TV series that has woven its way into the fabric of our entertainment history, we find ourselves standing at the crossroads of nostalgia and appreciation. This show, like an old friend, has walked alongside us through the corridors of time, leaving behind indelible imprints on our hearts. Each episode, each character, each twist of fate has etched a unique mark in the annals of television. And as the final curtain falls on this cherished series, it's not just a farewell, it's an invitation to embark on a personal voyage through the memories it has forged within you. The sage wisdom of Cheyenne Bodie, the rugged landscapes that painted the backdrop of his adventures, and the camaraderie that transcends the screen, they all beckon you to pause, to reflect, and to share. Your thoughts, your experiences, your connection with Cheyenne hold a mirror to the impact it's had on your life. Whether it's a heartfelt memory that still warms your soul or a profound realization that dawned upon you while watching, your story is a testament to the series' enduring legacy. So, I invite you to take a moment, close your eyes, and let the echoes of Cheyenne's journey resound within you. And when you're ready, share with us your treasured memories, your musings, and your sentiments about this remarkable show that has traversed time and space to touch your life. Thank you for joining in this celebration of Cheyenne for allowing its spirit to live on in your own words, and for sharing your personal voyage through its captivating tales. Your memories, your stories, they become the bricks that continue to build the monument of Cheyenne's impact. With a heart full of gratitude,